Well, after coming under intense pressure for not seeing the conditions at Rikers firsthand in years, Mayor de Blasio now says he will be visiting the troubled jail next week. Sharon Crowley here now with more on the calls for the federal government to step in as well. Sharon. Yeah, a lot going on, Steve. New York's congressional representatives in Washington calling on President Biden to help fix Rikers. The letter signed by eight lawmakers saying New York City is simply not capable of safely managing the custody of those in its charge and incarcerating, incarcerated in its jails. Now the mayor talking on the radio today vowing to make a personal visit to Rikers next week. I'll go to Rikers Island. I've said this repeatedly. New York City Mayor Bill de Blasio facing mounting pressure and criticism announcing he will visit Rikers Island. Next week I'll go visit. Uh, I think it's time because we've been able to address a number of issues and I want to see if these solutions are working or whatever other things we have to do. Democratic mayoral nominee Eric Adams, one of the many voices calling on the mayor to visit the jail and bring along other members of his administration. Public advocate Jumani Williams says the mayor's failure to visit the troubled facility since 2017 is, quote, a dereliction of duty. Eight members of Congress who represent New York today sent a letter to President Biden and the Justice Department demanding an investigation into civil rights violations on Rikers Island. The facility has a long history of violence and understaffing, leading officers to work double and triple shifts, creating dangerous conditions. The pandemic adding to the chaos there, 10 inmates have died at the prison since the beginning of this year. There's been a breakdown in basic services and operations in Rikers Island, and there's a crisis of confidence in the city's capacity to ensure the safety of those who are, are employed or incarcerated at Rikers Island. Congressman Richie Torres represents New York's 15th congressional district. He joined lawmakers asking President Biden and the DOJ to intervene at Rikers. The city has fundamentally failed to get a grip on the crisis of violence that has spun out of control in Rikers Island. And demands are growing to close the jail. Rikers is slated to close by 2027. A federal monitor today also, who's assigned to Rikers Island, called for an emergency hearing to ask for outside security to help. Steve. All right, thanks, Sharon.